Welcome to Ripka Fly Fishing TV. So today you're going to see a pretty cool video. I was actually stunned. Um, some of you saw a little teaser on my Instagram. If you don't follow my Instagram, follow my Instagram. If you're seeing this on Facebook, move to Instagram. It's better. Anyway, uh, so I'm not going to hide it. We caught a huge bass, uh, five pounds dead on. I weighed it with my scale. This isn't like an eye measurement. I thought it was bigger, that's why I scaled it. Five pounds. Uh, camera quality during this is not great. Uh, I'll make sure there's some pictures at the end. I'm pretty much just gonna roll, once I knew it was big, what I have, because I wasn't trying to make a video or anything, just trying to enjoy the night. But, yeah, it's big thing is huge and it's my new personal best five pounds honestly living in central pennsylvania i don't see me beating that anytime soon uh yeah so five pound pa bass that's massive i've only know of one person catching a six i've heard a couple people catch six but yeah five pound largey googan crack and claw crack and crawl wow it's early in the morning, I can't speak. That right there is what I caught it on. Hopefully you guys can see that. We'll rotate it a little bit more. Anyway, thanks you guys for watching. I'll catch you at the end of this, um, and we'll talk about what I was using. For those of you who want to stay, I'll explain more after I roll these clips and some pictures that my mom got for me. Well, thank you guys. That's a good one. I have never had a bass take wine. <laughs> Jesus God. That was huge. Get away. He's going under you. Holy cow, that's my biggest bass ever. I'm shaking. Oh. Oh my god. Okay. I'm so happy I grabbed my net. I wasn't going to bring the net. I'm letting him get some air. Here we go. It's not zeroed currently. Come on, cooperate. That's a five pound bass. Five one. I'm recording. 
Okay, try to just get some pictures, because I am too. <whistles> Renee's missing all this. Okay, you ready for some photos? Oh, did you give him a kiss? I did, because I kissed big fish. It's a big female. Is she okay? Yeah. Okay, well, you don't get to see it with your own eyes, Renee. Here we go. Here's a look for you guys. And that fat thing right there. Look at those buggy eyes. I don't know how to release this thing and not flip the kayak. Well, hopefully to catch a bigger one. Goodbye. Well, you guys just saw it. That was awesome. Uh, I This is my second time filming this, but, uh, you know, GoPro. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. I want to say that first because a lot of you aren't going to say through all this, but five pounds, Guggen Crack and Crawl, pegged Texas rig. So pegged, you know what the pegs are. Uh, I'm not going to show you, but you peg the weight so it doesn't move. Um, peg that it was sitting on a big tree branch coming out like further than all the other ones I don't know why I just gave it a whole flip and boom uh, you missed like probably maybe 30 seconds of the fight because I couldn't get the GoPro turned on um, currently with my YouTube I'm gonna try to land the fish over get the camera angles maybe eventually that will change but that's my current thing that's why your camera angles aren't great um you just saw some pictures of what i just caught um some ones my mom took they're not amazing pictures but if you know me you'll be able to see how big the fish is i'm not gonna lie kind of big dude but anyway uh that's a big step for me i usually am a trout guy i've been teaching myself this bass thing for probably we're gonna say four years now and call it four years i think yeah but anyway uh, i gotta give a shout out to my buddy jt uh you you're the one who really helped me when i started because i didn't know anything and i'm not gonna brag but now i'm above you jt so there we go uh maybe i'll put a little shade in the comments but anyway thank you guys for watching uh that was insane Five pounds, little tiny lake. If you know where the lake is, though, let's not put it in the comments. I said it, but I cut it out of the video. Um, if you know where it is, just go fish it. Uh, those of you who are in the area, you'll be able to tell exactly where it is, uh, especially if you fished it before. It's pretty, it's not very big. But let's not put it in the comments just because I don't want people like, hey, you're giving away my fishing spot on YouTube to all oh, maybe 40 of you that are going to see this. But I, I don't know. It's just how people are. It's sad, but that's how it is. So I'm not going to say, don't say, please don't say. If you do say and I see it, I'm going to remove it. And that's not between you and me. That's because you can't follow directions. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. For those of you who are still around, make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you're not subscribed and just watch me catch a five pound bass out of a little Center County Lake, what are you doing? What are you doing? I'm that good. No, I'm kidding. Uh, just me. <laughs> Please like and subscribe. Thank you guys for all your support. Uh, it means a lot. With school starting here soon, I don't know what videos are going to look like. So enjoy this one. Please share it with your friends. Let people see this. Thank you guys. Catch you on the next one.